Yeah. Amen. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, shout it. Don't worry about the mother niggas, stay corny. Don't worry about the mother bitches, stay for me. I'm straight forward. I can't. Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Abby John, and I finally have the sneaker collection video for you guys. I just got back from Vegas, so my ears are a little popped right now. Um, so it's, sorry if I talk too quiet or too loud. I just can't really tell with my ears popped. But anyways, let's get into the sneaker collection. I'm not gonna go in any order. I'm just gonna grab a shoe. Uh, I have them all in my bed right now. So yeah, here's the first shoe. We got a Roshi, but not just any Roshi. We got the custom Wazoo Roshis right here. Um, so shout out to my aunt Sabrina for doing this for me too. She helped me with this custom and it's pretty clean that's it mm, here's the next shoe right here it's not laced up because I have the white laces on but I'm gonna sell them soon so I had to put the original laces back on but here it is some gel light threes it's the laces right here yeah uh, I'm gonna be selling these tomorrow um, shout out to my uncle for this shoe right here I got this as a birthday present so we got the Planet Racers with the Lace Lab Laces 3M. And this is just a pretty dope shoe. It's a little dirty right now and beat up because I wore these to Vegas. So, yeah, but these are just a really good daily shoe and really comfortable. Alright, I'm gonna get these out the way because I have no bucks. I got these for 10 bucks at Wash Got Soul. Um, these are my hooping shoes for outdoors, so that's why there's like a lot of scuffs and all that. But this is how I bought it right here, so I'm not really tripping, but the grip is still really good. So, 10 bucks. LeBron 12 All Stars and have these Kobe 8 milk snakes right here take these out for 20 bucks like a while back ago and these were my hooping shoes before the LeBrons so yeah I'm gonna sell these to my homeboy Isais so shout out to Isais real quick got these Oreo 4s right here really good shoe a nice beater you know black goes with everything and this Oreo midsole is just killer so yeah I have a lot of wear of these have to be one of the cleanest 4s ever um, shout out to my uncle again. He got these for me for Christmas. Um, he got the Harajis, and then I always swapped them myself with the lace up laces with the gold tip. So, yeah. Also got the OG laces right here. Alright, so I got these in a two for one deal. We got the Tuxedo 11s. These are really dirty and beat up right now as well, but I can clean them easily. Um, I brought these to my Las Vegas trip and wore these like most of the trip, so that's why they're really dirty on the midsole. Um, right here, I picked these up back in February. First ever raffle that I won. And my favorite 12 to come out this year, 2016 Master 12s. Really dope shoe, good detailing, good hints of gold and white around the shoe. So yeah, Master 12s. Alright, right here we got a Jordan 3 Retro. Um, I picked these up at Dunk Exchange a few years ago, maybe. Last year, I think, actually. Last year or two years ago. We got some beat up True Blue 3s. They weren't this beat when I got them, but these are my beaters. Like, paint cracking is really bad. And I need to get them repainted ASAP. And there's Heel Drag and everything, but threes are a good shoe to beat up so I really recommend that if you need a Jordan to beat up. This shoe has a lot of memories for me. Uh, my uncle got these for me. A different uncle, not the one that got me the Harachis and Planets, but when I was in fifth grade my uncle got these for me. Um, he was doing like a little, like a riddle with me and my cousins and whoever got the riddle right um, would get a pair of shoes. And these were the hottest shoes that just came out at Foot Locker. And like when I first seen these, these are just like, I fell in love. I really need another pair of these, but I can't find them anywhere. LeBron 8s, I'm not sure the colorway. But yeah, man, I hooped in these so much. Look at that, got the messed up air bubble and everything. But yeah, I'll never let go of these in my collection. These mean a lot to me. Um, so shout out to my uncle, rest in peace. <laughs> got another Jordan right here. Shout out to my boy, B Poop, real quick. Um, he got that birthday hookup for me right here. Let me show you. It says, happy birthday, JP. Hope you enjoy this gift. Shout out to him, man. 
He got he plugged me up real good. Carmine sixes. Uh, I lace swapped them with the black lace locks. They look pretty clean in my opinion. Um, yeah, man, this is just a classic shoe. Can't go wrong with some Carmines. When I was in Vegas, this guy on Facebook was selling some shoes, and he needed the money ASAP. So I asked him if I could PayPal him, and he said, "Yeah." So I haven't shown these on my YouTube yet, but some Bread 13s just caught these for 50 bucks. Crazy! I picked them up today. Um, I just got back from Vegas today, and then my mom picked me up from my grandma's house, and then we just went by Isaiah's house. Shout out to him for meeting him up for me. Um, Bread 13s, Red Box. All right, these shoes uh, were my old hooping shoes, like before those LeBron and Kobe's playoff twos. Look at this crazy beat up shoe. Um, outdoor hooping shoes. I don't know what to say. I wish I didn't beat these up. I really regret it because I got them for like 50 bucks. All right, I got these in a two for one deal. I'm gonna show the other shoe in just a minute. Um, what pair of shoes were they? Oh, some Cigar 7s I had a while back. So we got these clean pair of Olympic sixes. Always wanted a pair of these. Just really nice, clean shoe. My favorite navy blue colorway. Um, the Olympics. So yeah, I can't go too much into detail with these. I'll just do the talking. And here's the shoe that I got with the two for one deal with the Olympics. I didn't really care about the shoe. I just wanted the Olympics, but got these right here. I know I'm never gonna wear these. Uh, some Bobcat tens. Gonna let go of them soon. Um, Alright, we're coming down to the wire here. LeBron 11s. Pick these up today, actually, in Las Vegas. And this is why the box is really messed up. I really regret it. Um, the box is just beat up from my flight back. We got the What the LeBron 11s right here. Pretty good condition. Um, so, yeah, man. I might sell these tomorrow, Duck Exchange. If I don't, then it's just meant to be and I'm going to keep these because these are really nice and comfortable on feet. So, LeBron 11 with us. Or should I say with the LeBron 11s? It sounds better. <laughs> Alright, shout out to my boy Carlos. He hooked me up on these right here. My favorite ones of all time. Shattered backboards. Uh, man, this shoe is my favorite one. Um, has to be in the top three. Has to be. We got the white laces right here. And at first, when I got them, they had the white laces, but I bought some black laces from Lace Lab. Shout out to them. And yeah, so I watched got sold. The last one, um, not the last one, but the one in Kent, I believe. He sold me these for the homie discount. Shout out to him, man. I really wanted these when they first came out, but I didn't win the raffle. Um, I was in Las Vegas at the time, too, um, last summer. I didn't win, so yeah, it's just too much people in Las Vegas. Raffle. So when a raffle is ridiculous. My favorite shoe of all time. Favorite Jordan of all time. We got 2006 Metallic Fives. This is the shoe that got me started into the game. Um, I believe January, no February of 2015. This was the first Jordan that uh, started my collection. So I haven't worn these in a minute. Uh, I feel like it's gonna crumble anytime soon. So yeah, now they're just collecting dust, but it's just so precious, I don't want to wear them. I need to get a pair of 2011s, and I'll, I'll rock those heavily. Uh, this is the shoe that got me started with all these other shoes. But the first shoe I ever got, the first Jordan I ever got, was on my birthday in like 2008 from my aunt. And believe it or not, it was a pair of 8s. <laughs> Some Aqua 8s. And back then, I didn't even know like about Jordans and all that, so... Yeah, but shout out to my aunt. Got me my first pair of Jordans. Um, also got like some other shoes that you guys probably won't care about, some Sperry's, but yeah, man, that's my shoes, I believe it was like 18, 20 pairs of shoes, uh, no Yeezys or nothing, no $20,000 shoes, but this is just what I work with, and I feel really comfortable with this collection, you know, a lot of versatility, and uh, yeah, guys, that's about it for my sneaker collection, I hope you guys enjoyed, didn't really talk too much about each shoe, just wanted to do it really quick, um, but yeah, guys, stay tuned for Dunk Exchange vlog tomorrow. And we also got more vlogs of my summer and more sneaker videos. So, John Prang, signing out. Peace.